Hi, I'm Melissa, one of the renal dietitians with Next Stage Kidney Care, and today I'm going to tell you how to make renal friendly potatoes. These are step by step instructions on what to do to demineralize your potatoes, which is the same as leaching. So, this process takes over 16 hours. You want to give yourself plenty of time, and it's best to start it the night before. And if you do this process, exactly, you can pull off over 86% of the potassium. So, we have our potatoes peeled. I'm gonna finish slicing. You need to do slices that are 1 8 of an inch. So you don't want them too thick, or it's not gonna, the process is not gonna work well. When you're done, you're gonna stick them all in your colander and we're gonna rinse it with tap water that's 100 degrees. All right, I got my thermometer. Okay, we've got it at 100 degrees now. So we're gonna rinse our potatoes. And you wanna make sure you rinse them and drain them completely. I'm gonna leave the water running because we're gonna need it again in a minute. Okay. Looks like it's strained. And you want a large bowl. We're gonna pour your potatoes in. And you wanna fill it with four times the volume of water or more. So if you have a cup of potatoes, you want four cups of water. And we're using 100 degrees water again, and once it's filled with four times the volume, I'm gonna stir it. Okay, really full bowl here. I'm gonna turn off my water. I got my spoon. You wanna stir it for 15 to 20 seconds to get it all mixed up in there. Okay. Next, we let it sit for an hour. So it's been an hour. What we're gonna do next is drain out the potatoes. Let me put my colander in here. We're in a ooh, heavy bowl. We're gonna drain them out. There we go. Just lost one here. We're gonna place it back in your bowl. Make sure they're drained. And we're gonna refill it with cold tap water this time. Turn this on cold. There we go four times the volume. All right, my nice and heavy bowl here. So you take your spoon and you're gonna stir it for 15 to 20 seconds again. Okay. So to save some time, I've prepared a bowl overnight. So this step, I would normally put saran wrap over it, stick it in my fridge, and it would wait for 15 hours before we continue. But I'm gonna set this one aside and get the one I've prepared, and I'll show you the next steps. Okay, we've got our other bowl that has been soaking for 15 hours. Next, we're gonna use our colander again, and we're gonna drain it out. Go. Oh, we're missing one there. Make sure it's completely drained. And next we're gonna boil it. So you take a large pot, pour your potatoes in, and you just wanna cover it with enough water. And hold on to your pot. <laughs> Okay. So all we want to do at this point is boil it until it's tender. Okay, our potatoes have been boiling for a while, so let's check them out. Nice and tender. That means they're done. I'm going to turn it off. Bring my colander back over to my sink. 
carefully bring your potatoes over and we're going to drain them. There we go. All drained out. And our potatoes are done. Now you can prepare them as you desire. And don't forget, any potatoes you don't eat right away, you want to refrigerate.